One of my meetings, one of my employees was like, but you know, we're a team. And I was like, this is my damn company. Why did I say that? That was the worst thing I could have ever said and I wish I could have, I could take it back. I was always on my employees when things went wrong and being a startup, like one little thing could become a big thing really quick. And they was kind of scared to make decisions without me because every single thing they did, they was like scared to fail. It really hit me and I was like, okay, well, I gotta kind of change my style of being a leader. And I had to really figure out a way to get them to learn to fail fast and try new things and not being so timid and worrying about the boss jumping down on them. So once I realized that, I started switching things up and I started giving them more responsibilities and asking them, what would you do in that situation? Or what, what would you do? Or I don't know, what, what do you think? And I took the power out of my court uh, the ball out of my court and I put the ball in their court and I let them make all the decisions because people, when they come up with things, they will own it and they will take it to the next level. So I just let them do what they do when they have something and I feel like it could be better in a little way. I just let them go on with it and I'll say like, hey, what, what do you think about this? So if I do want to change it, I will ask them how do they feel about it and stray it in a way where they can actually make the decision to keep that ownership. So when I realized that what I was doing was really working, I had most like all, almost all of my leadership team working after hours. They were staying after work because they was owning everything that they was doing and they felt like they was the CEO of their department. And I started seeing them going harder, bringing ideas to the table, figuring things out, bringing things that I would have never even thought of. And I'm just like, holy crap, I would have never thought of that. And the company just started moving so fast and now they're making decisions without me and now they're putting systems in place to even uh, manage the people that's under them and now they're owning their position more, which in return is having a company move way faster than having a bottleneck waiting for a decision from me. You know, I have to let go in certain situations and let my employees do what they need to do to grow and to become better. So now by them owning their position and being the CEO of their department, now things are just going out of control. I would say viral.